y'all. Shay here. Welcome to Untubing Tuesday. We are going to untube two uh, beautiful craftably paintings today. Um, small disclaimer, um, I am filming in my new craft space and um, there's no carpet in here so there might be a little bit of an echo. We're still adding furniture and getting it set up. We just put this desk uh, together yesterday. And I've got new lights, so the sound, the lighting might be a little different. So we're just trying to tweak it a little bit. So hang in there with me while, um, while we get that done. And let me know down below um, how it looks and how it sounds so far. But we are going to get some sound treatments on the walls. And once I start putting diamond paintings on the wall, more furniture, I think it'll warm up the place and it won't be as echoey. All right. So today we're going to untube two of them. Okay, we've got the purple. And then here's one of their new colors, a seafoam green. So these are two newer paintings. And uh, the reason why I have the toolkit out, because I wanted to point out a change that Craftably has made. Um, in the past, Craftably had their toolkits inside the tubes, okay? But what was happening is they were pressing up against the paintings like this, and they were crushing the paintings just a little bit on the ends. So Craftably uh, listened to us, and they made a change. So it's on the outside of the tube. So be sure after you open up your box that you dump your box out and make sure that you find your toolkit, because it'll be in there. And if it's not for some reason, contact them. But it should be in the top or the bottom, depending on you know what side you open up your box. But yes, that's where they're placing them now and it's made things a lot better. Okay, let's go ahead and start with the purple tube, okay? It's the big one. So we'll start with that one first. So how is everybody today? You having a good Tuesday so far? I am, I'm hanging in there. It took me a while to get this setup going, but you know, this is what I've gotta to do to get things, you know, with all new equipment and, whole new room and see. it's just yeah so I'm a little tired even though I have I just started filming because <laughs> I had to get it just right and I know the lighting is still a little off but we're getting there all right so enough about that let's go ahead and talk about the painting we're going to be looking at today the craftably does include this cool little tag at the end of the at the end of the tube so you can see the painting this is 2169 TC and it is a gorgeous gorgeous purple moonlit beach and it is licensed artwork by anthony cassay but yes look at this let me zoom in just a little bit more so y'all can see this is that not beautiful so if you love purple this is your painting yes and it is a 36 by 24 inches you can see that here but if you're a centimeter girl or guy then it's a 91 by 61 in centimeters okay it does have 62 colors it has two rhinestones and one AB. A lot of their, their rounds have rhinestones, the squares do not. So I always remember round, rounds and rhinestones. All right, so let's go ahead and get into this painting. It's a good size. I like how the, it's a lot of purple and it's in the purple tube. That's not guaranteed. It might be in any color tube. Now again, this is a telescoping tube if you've never seen this before. It does kind of, you just notch it. See, notch it down or you can notch it back up. And then you just pull this to make it larger. Yeah, it's great. I love their tubes. I store a lot of my paintings in these. All right, so it does come in a really protective, nice protective dust bag. All right, y'all ready? Let's do the drill, reveal. Oh my gosh, look at these colors. So I hope y'all can see, I hope the lighting is where I want it to be. So we've got some really pretty, ooh, 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 wait, 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 wait. Ooh, I see the two rhinestones. So it looks like there's a yellow and an orange. And then I see a purple AB, very nice. Okay, let's go ahead and take a look at the rest of these colors. Where's all the purples? Oh my gosh, look at all those, you guys. Look at all those colors. Let me turn it to the side. I think it'll look a lot better. Oh, look at all the purples. You know there's a 550 in there. Okay, so of course Craftably does have them individually bagged and they are in order. So if you wanna work straight out of baggies, you can do that. And they also put a sticker on here. So if you do store your drills separate than your painting, you'll know what goes to what. Yeah, I like how, how nicely packed the drills are. Okay, we'll look at those in just a minute. Let's go ahead and look at the painting. One through 62. Wow, and of course the rhinestones are at the bottom. The LZ is the rhinestones, and then it's got AB. So those are the last three right there. Oh, great colors. Is there a 550 in here? Oh yes, there is, 550 right there. 
course. All right, let's take a look at this. You guys ready? Oh my gosh, look at this beautiful painting. <gasps> oh, I love this. Let me move everything. Wow. Sorry about the glare. Let me lift this up a little bit so y'all aren't getting, or I can move my lighting actually. Let's try that. There we go. Move my light a little bit so you're not getting all that glare. How's that? Look at this painting. Look at this. All right, so you've got the moon right here. You've got the clouds, the light purple. You've got this beautiful tree right here. Love these flowers, the pop of yellow and this like fuchsia pink. The waves crashing, you've got some blue in here. Look at the reflection right here. It's almost like some tide pools. And then of course on this side, same thing. There's uh, more flowers. The flowers are up here. It looks like there's like, you know, you can see them. The coves back here, the mountains, the cliffs, another big tree. Oh, you guys, this is beautiful. Oh my gosh. Okay, so when you unwrap your canvas, there is some paperwork inside, so let's cover that, okay? I just wanted to get into this painting. I'm so excited, you guys. All right, so you do, you do get a welcome letter from Craftably. And in here, it explains everything that comes in your kit, okay? And on the other side is how-to diamond paint instructions. And then, here's your stickers. And Craftably does include a logbook sticker. So if you keep track of you know, your paintings and your start date and finish date. And then these are the best part. These are individually cut. They're peel and stick labels. You just peel them right off and put them on your storage containers, okay? Look at all those colors and symbols. And then they also include some fun stickers, which is really cool. All right, so let's see where the two rhinestones and the AB goes. Yeah, I just love this painting. I love the beach and the beach at night is just something that's just so special, and just so beautiful. All right, now, like I said, they're at the very end of the, the line, right, of the legends. So they're always gonna be, the ABs and the rhinestones are always gonna be at the end, which is so nice. I can just pull them right out. Oh, look at this purple, you guys. It's this beautiful, like, lavender. Look at that. Okay, and then the rhinestones, like I said, we've got this yellow and then this really pretty orange. Hopefully y'all can see those. Yes. Okay. All right. Let's see, close this back up. So let's take a look and see where, let's see, let's do, the, let's do the AB first. And again, for those of you that may not be familiar with this, AB stands for Aurora Borealis, and it's a special coating they put on the drills to make them sparkle just a little bit brighter. So that's gonna be 60, and that's the C symbol, okay? Let's see where the C is. All right, I'm gonna, I wonder if it's by the moon? No, okay, I am seeing it here. So just by starting off right here, I'm gonna bring y'all up so you can see it closer. Bring y'all up. Okay, so here's the moon, right? So up here in these clouds, you can see the seas. Make sure y'all can see those, plus you can check out the drill field quality. But there's a little bit of that light purple just kind of over here, okay? Also in this cloud over here, I see some seas. Also more over here. So yeah, they're highlighting these clouds. Oh, that's so pretty, I see them over here. Yeah, so all throughout these clouds, just kind of outlining them. That's where I see majority of them. They're right here. Yeah, they just kind of go all down here where the clouds are. Oh, that's gonna be really pretty. And of course, you know, this cloud, same thing, all kind of, and then it goes in the center, outlining this one. Also here. Oh yeah, that's gonna look so good. I love that. Yes. Okay, so let's see where these rhinestones go. All right, so 62 is that orange. And yep, it's gonna be down here in these flowers. This is gonna be the orange and the yellow. Let me just double check the yellow symbol. Yep, okay, perfect. So yeah, all through here, it's gonna be the rhinestones. So those flowers are really gonna pop. It's gonna be on this side too. And there's some over here as well. Okay, love this one. So again, um, it's 2169TC. 
And again, it is licensed artwork. Um, let's kind of cover this real quick. You know, you've got Craftably up here. They do include a legend on the left-hand side, okay? And then also there's a thumbnail down here with the artist, okay? And then there is a legend over here on the right with another thumbnail, the size of the painting, everything you need. Let's check stickiness just for, just to say we did. All right, nice and sticky. And like I brought y'all up already, the drill field is very, very clear. I love these waves. I think it'd be even fun like to maybe put some blue in here, some aqua colors. What do y'all think? I'll have to see what ABs I have, but yeah, look at the drill field. That looks very, very clear. I'm not gonna have any problems whatsoever. Okay, all right, y'all, let's move on to the next one because I know we've got two to do today. I don't want the video to be too long. I'm gonna pause you, uh, put this away, and then pull out our other one. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Real quick, I set this on the floor to wrap it back up and get it all um, back in the tube. And I just wanted to show you guys this to get another feel for this painting. It is, it's beautiful. I don't know if I had more of a glare on the table. Again, we're kind of playing around with lighting and with everything, but I put it on the floor and I just thought, oh my gosh, it's absolutely beautiful. Je Jasper. <laughs> Y'all, <laughs> there's still the clear plastic on there, so it's safe. Jasper. Oh my gosh, I better not call him back over here. But yes, um, without Jasper, I wanted to show y'all just the reflection right here with the moon, you know, just coming down in the entire painting and just the lighting. It's just beautiful, absolutely gorgeous. Okay. I'm back, let's go ahead and look at this next one. Um, I don't think we had a chance to look at the toolkit in our last opening, I got so excited about that painting. Um, so let's go ahead and take a quick look at this. It is a soft burlap bag that you can reuse for several different things. I keep my washi tape in here that I'm using and I keep a lot of fun stuff in here. Um, okay, so in here is your basic toolkit, but it's not basic. It's your unbasic toolkit. So you do get a white tray, okay? Let me bring this up to y'all. You get the white tray, and then you get your pen with a four-placer, a thin one, and then there's a squishy for your pen. You get a pair of tweezers, you get a pink plate of wax, another four-placer, and then my favorite, you get a thin seven, you get a seven-placer, okay? So yes, everything and then some. But wait, there's more. They also include two random rolls of washi tape, Okay, look at these. How adorable are those? You've got some pears and then some green stripes. And then they also include a pot of pink wax and it's branded with craftably on it. And it's got the little twist off lid. I love their pink wax. So I love that they come in these little containers and they also keep them in this baggie in case, you know, something happens during shipping, it won't get under painting. So they're very careful with everything. And then last but not least, you get this adorable you get a random little cover minder in this cute little case. So it looks like we have the little teardrop. Look at that little guy, he's so cute. And the magnets are strong. Yeah, and he's got little little rhinestones in his cheeks and little black ABs. Oh, he's so cute, you guys. And there's I've seen different colors of these guys. There's lots of different cover minders out there that I've seen. All right, so that's the toolkit. Let's go ahead, let me move this on this side. All right, I'm still trying to get my bearings. My bearings. Let's move on to our next one, and that is Tiger Loving Tessa. Y'all, I love a good Sheena Pike. Look at this one. So it is licensed artwork by Sheena Pike. It's an 18 by 24 in inches, and it is a beautiful painting. Look at all those tigers, all the orange yellows, even some a lot of purples. Really, really nice painting. And I haven't really seen a whole lot of this one, so I thought I would unbox it. All right, so it's in the dust bag. And let's get our scissors. Okay. Let's see. I did not look up all the other details on their website. I was being lazy, y'all. Let's just get into it and find out for ourselves what we've got here. Let's go ahead and do the drill reveal real quick. And then we'll have an idea of, oh, it's a square. Ooh, that's a surprise. Yeah. I see a white AB right there. See that special coating on there? What else we got? Ooh, yes. We've got a lime green. We've got a purple. Oh, this is gonna be awesome. Sorry, y'all can't even see what I'm doing. Yes, let's see what else we get. What else we got? 
Oh yes, look at all those oranges and browns and purples and pinks. Oh yeah, I love this color palette. That is amazing. Look at those. Look at all these fun colors. That's a great orange right there. Wow. Oh yeah, I'm loving this one. Okay, again, until you actually see it, you don't know. This is not one that was on my radar. Yes, love this. Okay, so let's get our, let's get the paperwork out before we take a look at her. Oh, she's cute, y'all. Okay, so again, how to diamond paint instructions. You get a letter from Craftably on the other side. And then here's our stickers. We have got 59 colors. One, two, three ABs. Now there are no rhinestones because it's a square, remember, just for rounds. And again, it's got the logbook sticker, the individually cut, you know, peel and stick labels. Just boop, stick it on your container. All right, let's get into this. Yes, let me roll her backwards real quick. I just kind of, you know, put it on the edge of the desk and it just kind of catches. And then it's just an easier way to roll it backwards. But I don't want you able to see. I'm trying to keep it a surprise. Oh my gosh, she's so cute. You guys, I love her. Oh my gosh, you guys, look at her. She's so cute. What a great size. What do we say again? An 18 by 24 in inches? That's awesome. That's a perfect size. Look at this. Oh my gosh, look at how cute she is. And I love her little tiger coffee cup and it's got like a little plant in it. <laughs> and her handbag, look at her purse with a little purple flower on the side. I like the hearts in the background on the wall. And her yellow flower, oh, I'm loving her. I love her glasses, her eye color. Oh my gosh, you guys. All right, I'm loving this. Let's see where the 80s go. And again, individually bagged and in order. And it's got the great sticker on here. Look at all these oranges and yellows. Man, I don't wanna do this one. All right, sorry about the crinkle. I try to be gentle. I don't want to get anything out of order. And again, they're always right at the end. So we have this lime green. We've got a purple. It looks like the same purple from the last kit we looked at. Ooh, a big bag of white. Is that it? Yeah, I think we said three. Oh, I love that peach color. All right. Let's see where these go. There's a lot of white. So let's start with the green. That's this little circle. Okay, I see it right off the bat. So the green and the plant, let me go ahead and bring this up to y'all. Um, it's a symbol right here. See the, with the black, half of the circle's black. So, so it's gonna be here, all through here. So all through that plant, kind of outlining it. Um, let me see if I see it anywhere else. It wasn't a huge bag. So that might be, I don't really see green anywhere else. Nope, not in here, over there. Okay, yeah, so she's gonna be in the plant right here. That's gonna be cute. And then 58 is this really pretty purple. And again, AB stands for Aurora Borealis. It's that special coating, you can see it just glistening. Okay, this is the G symbol. G, G, G. Where would a G be? Okay, so this flower is really gonna be blinged out. See, I see it right here. It's all gonna be this outlining, and it's even in the center of this flower. These three little flowers right here. There's a lot of G's. Okay, and I also see some, oh wow, y'all, those same flowers over here. I see a lot of G's. So I see some here, and then all throughout here, throughout these flowers. Sorry, I'm trying to keep y'all up close. Yep, these are all those G's. Oh, that's gonna be so pretty. That purple is gonna make those flowers just beautiful. All just outlining all the flower. Okay, let me see if I see it anywhere else. Um, let me see her glasses. Oh, yep, the flower over here. So this, yeah, these particular flowers, I don't see it here or over. Oh yeah, I do see some down here. Yeah, I missed the ones down here, y'all. Um, yeah, those flowers are really gonna pop. There's gonna be the green, the, not the green, the G. Yep, and there's more on this side. I see a few here. And then where I saw more was over here on this other, the same flowers. It's in her hair over here. See, it's all outlining. 
There's a lot of those. It's all through here, all through these flowers. Even up here, I see some. Yeah. All right. Okay, let's see where this big bag of white goes. Let's see, look at this, this is a big bag. All right, those look so good. Look at the shimmer on those. All right, this is the O symbol. It's always the O symbol. I noticed with practically they always have the O symbols, they're white. Um, it's in the tigers and also in the cup. So let's just start at the bottom. There's all this white right here, see that? So part of the tiger, his mouth is all gonna be O's. In his ears, top of his head, and then all throughout her shirt, all this white. That's all gonna be white ABs. Wow, okay. And in her, is that a necklace right there it looks like? Yeah, or at the top of her shirt, looks like a little paw print. Yes, all that outlining. Let's see where else, um, over here. I see a lot of O's, O here. And I did see some over here in the tiger. All throughout, oh, on top of his eyes, wherever you see white, I'm seeing a lot of the O's through here. Oh, that's gonna look so good. Okay, let's see about her face. Okay, she's got some on her lips. I see some right here, on her lips. And she's got some in her eyes, so in the center of her eyes, and also right here, and a little here, and here. Same with her other eye, it's gonna be the same there, and over there. And, oh, there's some right here on top of her, you see some on her nose. And there's some over here. Wow, you guys, this looks so good. And then they've got just strips of it here and here. And again, in this tiger, there's lots in the white of the tiger, kind of the stripes. Yes, oh yeah, okay, this is gonna be phenomenal. All right, and again, these white stripes right here, it's all O's, O's. It's all gonna be that white AB. It just kind of goes all the way across. And also, I see it back here in his ears, the tiger's ear, yeah, it's everywhere. All right, y'all, I'm excited about this one. Tiger loving Tessa, look at her. It's a great size. Let's check the stickiness real quick. Yep, and we already checked the, the drill field. We've covered everything else with the other painting. Yep, okay, so y'all go check out Tiger Loving Tessa. And uh, also, the other one we opened, it's got a number, 2169TC, I believe is the number. Um, go check out both of those, and I hope y'all enjoyed this. If you did, um, go ahead and give me a thumbs up at the bottom of the video. And then also, if you haven't subscribed yet, I would love to have you. So go ahead and hit subscribe down there, and then also next to it, there's a bell. And that's a notification bell, and it notifies you whenever I post up any new videos. And I post up about every other day, every two days sometimes on average. Um, I do unboxings, whipping chats, um, shopping videos, a little bit of everything. And I also go live on Sundays. So yes, please join me. Okay, y'all, this is it for me. I'm gonna go ahead and get out of here. Hopefully um, you enjoyed this new, you know, setup, sound, all that good stuff, um, lighting. So thanks for being here with me and kind of helping me along through this process. Um, we'll get it, okay? All right, love you guys, take care, and I'll see you in the next one. Okay, bye guys. Bye.